Eu. Wait, are you following me? Ah. I think this is the first time you actually have a companion working with you. That'd be actually cool to have. To have like a companion working around you. Maybe all the team. It's getting clearer. No. This is the chasm. What did we go through here? If we just in that battle for years ago. What is he doing here? The one I met. Is that the production? Okay, the effect that they use are kind of annoying. The voice is much clearer now. We're close. Conqueror of Demons, can you hear me? It's Yenfei. The Traveler and I are trying to find you. Uh, traveler? Yenfei? It worked. Are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. Listen to me. It's chaotic here. We may not be in the same space, but sometimes the sound can get through, which means these separate spaces intersect from time to time. Everything is chaotic here. No. The darkness that sullies my soul is harmful to mortals. Right now, we have more dangerous things to worry about than that. This space is using our urge to find you to lure us into traps. Without you here with us, our search for you could very well lead us into danger. So, you're in danger too? There was no need for you to search for me. But we're worried about you. And earlier, the Traveler was tricked into entering a dangerous place. How do we meet? Conqueror of Demons, can you find out where our voices are coming from? Find the spot where our voices are the clearest and try... something there. It might work. I see. The spaces may intersect amidst the chaos. By try something, do you mean... Hurry! If we miss this chance, we might not get another one. Hmm. And he's gone. Stand back. Uh oh. <laughs> what? No. <laughs> I was kidding. <sighs> he actually used his E. Let's get him back to the camp. <sighs> now we can avoid getting split up. A lot's happened here, but this wasn't just for our own safety. You're injured. We can't just leave you alone. It's just a flesh wound. I am fine. I shouldn't let myself be a burden to you. You're not a burden. Don't think that for one second. We need you, all of us. For our sake, please, stay here, please. Fine. 
As you wish. You're injured. Get some rest. Everything else can wait. <sighs> All right. Wait, we got the achievement? You don't look well. I guess things still haven't improved. It's okay. You don't have to go into all the detail. <sighs> Sometimes I really envy the boss. <sighs> hmm. As expected, something strange is going on here. Traveler? You're both here. Great. I want to talk to you. I also felt that the space was targeting us, but Yenfei managed to exploit its weakness. <laughs> Leave it to Yenfei to find a loophole. Based on what just happened, we can now confirm our suspicions that space and time function chaotically here. In addition, we must stay vigilant to avoid the traps set for us by this place. Now that we've found the Conqueror of Demons, the next thing we need to do is find a way out. I went back to the Domain again just now. Although I couldn't find a new route, it wasn't a completely fruitless trip. My clan has practiced magic for generations, and has created some catalysts that only we know how to use. I recognized something like one of those catalysts in the Domain. Unfortunately, it disappeared as soon as I approached it. I think so, but it's hard to distinguish between reality and illusion here. I can't be sure. Also, I am the only one out of all of us who could know what it would look like. To me, that confirms that this place really is reading our minds. Just like with that door. It's like it's alive, and testing us. By reading our minds and showing us what we want, it creates the reality that we want to be true. Everything it does is either to get us to lower our guard, or to wear us down. If that's the case, it can only have one goal. To trap us here until we die. What else could it be? We should prepare for the worst, but we mustn't give up. I've always known there were secrets hidden in the chasm, but even the Qixing have never heard about anything like this. Yelon, when we first ran into you, you said you had something to do. What were you referring to? <sighs> I... was looking for the truth behind the monster invasion from Conria. Wait, can you? Wait, but isn't that place like in ruins 500 years ago? Please keep everything I'm about to say to yourselves. No one else can know. Otherwise. We got it. Five hundred years ago, a wave of dark beasts from Conria attacked the Seven Nations of Tevat. Naturally, Liyue was also affected. Uh, why do I feel that they're gonna... the guys from Celestia plotted this that... 
Okay, I'm not gonna say the name. The K Nation. They. What's the word? They lie about and make like the nation was the one that attacking the Celestia gas took the hero job to say okay now sound confusing under rex lapis's command the millilith fought hard to hold the front line near the chasm but these were vicious beasts and this was the most desperate battle liue had ever faced at a critical moment someone distracted the monsters and led them away just when all hope seemed lost, the tide turned. The Liyue army eventually won the war, but there were many who never returned. Two of my ancestors took part in that war, and the one who made it back went insane. Everything about it was strange. The current generation of Qixing knows very little about these events, and very few came back from the chasm alive. Finding out the truth? has been a waiting game. The day the chasm was unsealed, I put in a request to be transferred here, so I could finally learn the truth of what happened back then. But this place we've ended up in, and the possibilities we're facing, it's all far more terrifying than I'd imagined. <sighs> we can't give up. Right now, our number one priority has to be getting out of here alive. Are you all right? You've suddenly gone quiet. It's not like you at all. Shh. We'll talk later. I'm just processing all the existing clues we have. Maybe the key to our escape is hidden in some detail I've overlooked. I have to go over everything again. All right. Well... Oh, don't worry. I won't write down anything that you told us about. No, I meant if you're going to analyze the facts, count me in. Look well. I guess things still haven't improved. It's okay. You don't have to go into all the details. <sighs> Sometimes I really envy the boss. Hey, Ushi. Looks like our little lavender melon has fallen asleep, huh? Do you think she's dreaming? Man, she looks wiped out. It's kind of hard to see her like this. I mean, most of the time she never shuts up. Aw, poor thing. And that little dude looks done in too. Ah, I'm kind of worried about him. Oh, I sleep like this when I'm in jail? <laughs> Good one. <laughs> oh, I do slumber like a king. Traveler, when did you get here? Wait, it's all over? Okay, this is, I guess, gonna be the climax. I'm gonna take this. I really like this. Hmm. 
Although something weird I want to say about this. Is this a vent or the Alquan quest? Because this is the weird thing. Actually, let me check. Archive. So this is supposed to be the Ark One quest in a way. Where do you want to go next? I cannot like to tell. Sometimes they are mixing the story quest with the event. Can you see that? But I'm not gonna dwell too much in this. Hope you enjoyed this video. See you in the next part for the finale. And yeah, Cookie is gonna come out a little later. In 20 days or so. So see you in the next video. Aloha.